See, see what she's wearing this morning out walking around? There's her socks again. But I didn't walk in the in the grass because it's got frost on it. Oh my, my goodness. My poor grass got frost on it. Yep, that is frost. Not ready for this. See that neighbor's house. On the roof it's all white. Not good. Yep, good morning. Yeah, it's it's a um yeah, we're tired. <laughs> we're always tired. Yeah. Well, you know, we were supposed to take it easy yesterday and you you know, you seen that we didn't do that. So So this morning when we were getting gas, uh the, the gas station that we get gas at's right next door to the Gravely dealership and uh, we met the factory rep for our area, which is seemed to be a nice guy. We had a nice conversation with him, but and then we come over and did the, our first yard, and it is done for the season. We will not be back to this yard unless uh, the leaves all fall down before the snow. But eh, I don't think it's going to happen because we're supposed to get snow this weekend. Yeah, I know. I said it, snow. So we have a short day for us. I think there's only what seven lawns left to do, something like that. And we're going out to the farthest one away right now. Uh, to let these other ones uh, in our area dry up because there's a lot of shade and it's gonna well, we need everything we can get just to get them to dry up because they're not gonna dry up completely but we're gonna try and get something done something like that anyhow a lot of ramble in there yeah the decks would just all clog up like the neighbors they were the another lawn company was mowing their lawn and you could just hear it hesitating <laughs> because there was so wet yeah throwing clumps and when do you have frost on the ground and it's it's wet. Yeah, and that's what we're gonna fight with all the rest of the season is frost. We're not gonna have it for the next few days, but we're gonna have her for we, quite a bit. We get some more frost this weekend. The leaves are gonna come tumbling down. And that'll probably put us in the full blown leaf season. Yay! Because then we don't have to work in the twenties. That's what I'm looking for. We get them all cleaned up before it gets in the twenties for the highs. Because we don't work very well in the cold like that. Yeah, you do one yard and you have to take a 45 minute break. Well, it's sure turning out to be a nice day. It's up to 59 degrees from 32 degrees this morning with frost on the ground. But we're out driving around right now. We're doing some of our commercial properties that we have to go out of town with. And boy, it sure is a nice pretty ride. All the trees are turning nice. and. Lots of oranges and reds and yellows. And we were seeing a lot of campers and motorhomes going around too. They must be on their color, color tour. So the yards that we're getting right now is them, them, all them small commercial properties, all them little outbuildings there. And we're doing the last cuts for the season on them. And our contract will be done this week. We won't have to worry about them for the rest of the year. So it's a, it's a good thing. But it's also a sad thing. That means our season's getting really close to being done. It's going to get done before we have to work in the 20s. I'm hoping. I think that's the second time you said that. She's yes, I lot. did. I'm hoping that we're going to be all done with leaves before we get in the 20s. Oh, brother. Sure is nice out. It 61 is. degrees. And we just got done talking to this... Uh, customer of ours you've seen this house several times um, it's one out in the country the farthest away from our house here and no matter what's going on you talk to nice people and your day goes so much nicer so much better and just it's a 
I had a nice conversation with her. We lasted about a half hour, but yeah, so be it. You know, we have, uh, we're, like I said, we're slowing down. We're taking it easy this time of the year because the yards are going to get done no matter what because we're getting fewer and fewer every week. And this week, or this yard here just went to every other week. We just cut it short. And next week we won't be here because it did get hit with frost tonight. So that's going to slow it down real fast. We'll probably only be here one more time and that'll be it. So anyhow, we've got, I don't know, five or six more to go, I guess, or four or five. I don't know how we got to go, but still a beautiful day out. Okay, we are at a new property. Not a new customer, a new property. And uh, I'm going to mow this down at three inches. I'm going to bag it all up. It's not that big of a yard. It's a small yard, but I have to drive around the back after I get the front mode and go through the alley to get in the gate because it's the only way I get in there. Luckily, there's a gate in the back and I don't have to push mold it. So uh, let's get you set up and let's get this yard done. <laughs> Okay, that yard's all done. This is a rental property. Uh, the person owns uh, several rentals and we just keep grabbing more properties. And I like the properties that it gets because they're simple and they're small. And uh, we're gonna have probably one more cut here and that'll be a cleanup at the same time. So it's gonna be a pretty simple cleanup and so there's gonna be quite a few leaves here, but that uh, gravely will do a good job of picking everything all up all at once. 
So we have uh, just a handful of more properties to go today and we'll be done for the day, but it's 63 degrees. Just an absolute beautiful day for working. Good afternoon. Okay, we just got done with a yard that uh, the tiger lilies were all done. And I took the Gravely and approach here. I guess we should have got a video on it, just never got to it. Um, I mowed through the whole thing there, picked them all up, and that Protero never plugged up. Skag with that clamshell bagger, I wouldn't have gone through there at all. So things are uh, looking really good for us for the fall for the cleanup because I think it's going to be a we're going to go through these yards faster than we ever have. I know I've said that before, but I'm still thinking it's going to happen. As long as we don't have no breakdowns. She had to throw that in there. <laughs> well, the thing about this one that we just got done doing is this is the one that's got the hostas all the way around the whole yard. Yeah. And when this lady does not like us to trim them until like November. After Halloween, they can be mowed down. Right. But the thing is, is they're all dead now. And once we get more frost and more snow and rain, they're going to be all saggy. And I've already seen lots and lots of mold in them yeah. and them plants. And it's not healthy for the plants to leave them get all rotted like that but that's how she wants it done. But it's gonna to come to the point where we're gonna tell her, we're gonna be cutting these down this time of the year, and when the leaves fall down, we'll pick up the leaves. We'll see how it all happens and how things all go. Cause we're we supposed cut, to get snow this weekend, so we don't know. I already cut out some of the ones up by the front of the house. So we'll see what she says yeah, about we're that. Just, and I've been slowly taking some more and more every week. So by the time uh, it comes to the cleanup, we might just slowly have them all removed already and she not even notice it. So <laughs> we only hope. Yeah, we only hope. Because it's not doing anything for our yard. It actually looks kind of, it drags it, looks, it down. Yeah, it looks a little cruddier on there. But anyhow, now it is time for Vicki's question of the day. So we got up this morning and our nicely fresh cut lawn from yesterday was all white. As you've seen in the beginning of the video. We had frost. Have any of you folks had frost yet in your neighborhood? So there's a possibility of frost for us again tonight, but we'll see and that's going to be up for uh, about four or five days and then we'll go from there. But your answers down in the comment section below would be greatly appreciated. This is the third time we've tried to end this video now. <laughs> Too much fresh air today, I guess. Beautiful day of working and we really enjoyed ourselves today because it was nice out. A little chilly this morning, but that's okay. It was nice out. So please leave a comment down in the comment section below. Uh, like, subscribe, click the notification bell to be notified when the next video is released. Thanks for answering our question of the day. Together we will learn more. And I hope y'all liked my video last night on the HSA 25 Garden St Trimmer. By is Steel. By Steel. Peace. Goodbye.